in this video we'll learn how to draw an angle without using protector and how to draw the angle bisector of an angle so first let us see how to draw an angle without using protector or how to draw an angle of the same measure using compass so here first of all the angle already it is drawn using the protector angle of major 80 degree angle of major 80 degrees drawn now we have to draw the angle of same major a duplicate angle of same major but without using protector so we'll make use of compass to draw the angle so first we'll draw the base ray we'll name the ray as base ray as qr now we have to draw the angle of same major 80 degree so first keep the pointer of the protector at vertex of the angle abc that is b and draw a arc cut the arms of the both the both both the arms of the angles abc with suitable distance in the compass now don't change this distance with the same distance keep the pointer at vertex q and draw the arc of the same measure as that we had drawn in the angle abc now take distance equal to this much distance where the arcs are cutting both the arms of the angle and in the compass again see you have to take distance equal to in the compass equal to wherever the arc is cutting both the arms of the angle and same distance you should keep the pointer of the compass at ray qr where the arc which you have already drawn which is cutting there and cut the arc now join the point q and point of intersection of the both the arcs this is how we can draw the angle of the same major angle pqr is equal to angle abc if we measure this with the help of protector the angle will be of same 80 degree that of the angle abc so angle pqr and angle abc are of equal major second example draw an angle xyz of the same major that of angle pqr equal to 120 degree without using protector now here already angle pqr is equal to 120 degree which is drawn with the help of protractor now we have to draw the angle of same major but without using protractor so first draw the base ray yz ray yz now with the help of compass keep the pointer of the compass at q and draw the arc which will cut both the arms of the angle with suitable distance don't change the distance with the same distance keep the pointer of the compass at y and draw the arc of same length intersecting the ray yz now take the distance equivalent to the arc which is intersecting the cutting the arms of the angles distance the point of intersection say distance equivalent to this much in the compass and keep the pointer of the compass where the arc is cutting the ray yz and cut the arc now join the point of intersection of the arcs and vertex y this is how we can draw an angle x y z 
of same major that of angle PQR without using protector. We will learn how to draw angle bisector of a given angle of a given major. So, here first example is draw an angle bisector of an angle ABC is equal to 70 degree. So, first step we should we will draw the angle of major 70 degree angle of major 70 degree with the help of protector. So, first draw the base ray BC with the help of scale your ray is not having any length. So, ray BC. Now, angle ABC is 70 degree. So, with the help of protector, major angle ABC is equal to 70 degree. Now, we have to draw the angle bisector of this angle. So, angle bisector divides the angle into equal major two equal major this angle is 70 degree so angle bisector will divide this angle into two equal major that is 35 35 degree so now with the help of compass keep the pointer of the compass at b this is the steps to draw the angle bisector so cut both the arms both the arms of the angle ray ba and bc with the help of compass now wherever ray BC is intersected by the arc keep the pointer over there and take suitable distance and draw the arc exactly in the middle of the angle B lift the pointer keep the pointer wherever the arc is intersecting ray BA and intersect the arc now draw the angle bisector it will pass exactly it will divide the angle into two equal majors this is how we can draw the angle bisector of angle a b second example draw angle p q r is equal to 100 degree and bisect it here you have to draw the angle bisector of angle p q r are of a major 100 degree. So, first step, first step is to draw the angle PQR. So, first draw the base QR ray QR. Now, at point Q, make the angle of 100 degree. Now, 100 degree is an obtuse angle. So, 0 is pointing towards the ray Q R. So, here 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 90 here and 100, 100 is an obtuse angle. So, draw the obtuse angle properly. Now, after drawing the angle of 100 degree angle P Q R, now with the help of compass we have to bisect the angle into two equal majors. So, keep the pointer at Q and cut the ray Q, P and Q R in two points with the help of compass. Now, keep the pointer at point where the arc is intersecting Q R, take suitable distance and draw the arc exactly in the middle of the angle in front of the vertex Q. With the same length in the compass, keep the pointer at the arc wherever it is intersecting QP, ray QP and from that point cut the another, that arc. Now join the point of intersection of two arcs and vertex Q. This is how we can draw the angle bisector of an angle PQR. You can verify the this two majors are of equal length with the help of protector. 
it should pass from now it is angle is of 100 degree so exactly the angle bisector should pass from 50 degree exactly it will pass through 50 degree then we can verify that our angle bisector is accurate third example draw angle xyz is equal to 90 degree and draw its angle bisector so first draw the angle to draw the angle first draw the base y, yz ray yz we have to draw first ray yz now with the help of protector make an angle of 90 degree at y draw an angle at of 90 degree major angle x y z is 90 degree so 90 degree angle angle x y z is 90 degree now we have to bisect this angle we have to draw the angle bisector which will divide the angle into two equal major so keep the pointer at y and intersect ray y x and y z in two points by drawing the arc now wherever arc is intersecting y z keep the pointer over there and take then suitable distance and draw one arc exactly in the front of vertex y of angle x y z and keep the pointer at another arc where it is intersecting ray y x and cut that arc and join the vertex and point of intersection of both the arcs this is how we can construct an angle bisector we can draw the angle bisector of an given major all of you draw this examples in your notebook